Alrighty. <clears throat> so, what I was doing last time, I, I realized that my time frame got... Why does it always unshift me? Weird. So last time when we were playing, what happened was we had gotten a bunch of water set up. And we had set up, I think, one fuse for it. One production fuse. What we discovered is we are... Um, we have a bit of a bottleneck and what the bottleneck is is that we need a crap ton of credits over here um yeah so we have a total of 2100 credits right now and we need two energy multiplier fuses in order to get to the um portal in order to build the portal we need two energy fuse multipliers which is 12,000 credits. And the main issue is we are not producing very much. Yeah, like, yeah. Our inventory size is not pulling very much money very fast. And it's not going to while we're actively working on other stuff. So for example, oh, um, something I did real fast I realized that beans are going to get sucked up by the honey to produce the high quality food to, to then ship the high quality food. And so because of that, I'm not going to have a lot of food on hand. So I prioritized a high quality food chest first. So this should inherit a full load of the high quality food and then the rest will go to the thing. We do need more mushrooms. That's right. We have some fertilizer twos. Our fertilizer ones are coming back in. We needed to set up a couple of these. But I need to see if we have any bees at the moment. Okay, all y'all are full. Let's come over here to the dump. I don't see any bees. There might be more bees upstairs if we have any. We do not. My guess is that I made a wave of bees and then put them all into those. And we haven't had another round yet. Which is kind of a problem. What do I have here? That's enough recourse, recourses, resources for one auto crafter and then a little bit of other stuff. Uncommon. Did we unlock tier two yet, mutagen? We have not. Okay. And that's okay. We're almost up to mutagen four and we don't even have mutagen two yet. Gotta love that. The water collector. Okay. Water life collector is a bit off. We're almost up to the insect spreader rocket, but that will also require bees. And then we need a lot more insects. Okay, but we need the rockets to do the insects. So what we need to do right now is I need to come over here and I need to grab the bee recipe. And I need to figure out how many uncommons do we have right now? Almost none. We have like maybe less than 10. So, Do I currently have a good way to collect larva? <clears throat> I need a ton of larva. Which is the issue. We need a ton of larva. <clears throat> Pardon me, I just ate. And we primarily need uncommon larvas. I think we can keep getting rid of the commons. The one option would be to do a quick journey to the mushroom area and see if we can get some uncommons and then maybe like a, <coughs> pardon me, see if we could get a couple uncommons and maybe even get our hands on a few more Futura. Because those seem to be what we're missing most right now are those. 
A lot of commons. Oh, the other option is to go to the super cave, because the super cave is really tight. And so all of the larvae that do spawn in are really, really close together. Like you basically, um, what's the other one that has the same problem? Um, the Osmium Cave does it as well. There's two or three spots where it's really easy to just stand there and collect a crap ton of larvae. And it's because the rooms aren't very big. Like, I can show you. If we go over here and then we teleport to, say, um, Super Cave. So the Super Cave isn't very big, right? This is a very small area. So if we stand here for just a minute... If we stand here for just a minute, um, larvae should start spawning like crazy. Oh, yeah, see? Uncommon, uncommon... Common. And basically what it is, is this is an extremely tight cave. So there isn't a lot of surface area for the larva to spawn in. So they're just all right here. There's one up there. Oh, come on. There we go. Another one over here. But yeah, basically we can just stand here and after about four seconds we'll have a full inventory of larvae. I don't know if there's any special larvae that appear in this cave. Not that I know of. I see you. It's an uncommon too. How many uncommons are we up to? Wow. Quite a few, which is very good. But yeah, the Osmium Cave is the other one that you can do this in as well. Or the cave is really tight, and so there's not a lot of surface area. Pretty much any of those caves like that. So, like, the Uranium Cave could do it. Uranium could. Osmium could. Super could. Um, Iridium is a little bit bigger of an area, and it's a little darker. So, I don't know how easy it would be to do that one. One more. Preferably a uncommon if we can. The nice thing, though, is because we're doing it in just such a tight cave, um, it's quite fast. So, there we go. See? We just did a full inventory's worth, and it took us, like, a minute. Let's go home. And I think... I think we're just going to dump those ones. Oh, look at all our pulsar. Super one two three one two three four. Since we have so much of this, I want to keep doing that. Oh, dumped crap all over the floor. Whoopsie. <clears throat> Say quick to the secret lab. Uranium rods. Water, which I was, I was going to say should be fairly empty again. There we go. Let's pick up our... Oh, come on. Sweet. But yeah, we should be able to scale up lots of drills at this point. Um, having this pulsar automated is so... helpful. Th that just told me something. We need a lot more robots, is what I just learned. Whoops. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's when you drop, like, eight new robots in, and they immediately all have assignments. Let's see what we can do here. Don't more. There we go. Yeah, we're up to 51 rockets, or 51 drones, and all of them have a job. Which just shows how much is going on. Okay, uh, real fast, let's check our power. 1923. Okay, we've got a goodly amount of power. We need to focus down more of the uncommons here. Okay. 
seem to have a bunch of weird things in my inventory. So let's take care of that. Let's get the explosive out of here. Let's get the... Is it nitrogen? No. It's methane. For some reason, I had a methane in my inventory. And an oxygen. Two oxygens, even. Okay. Osmium is not full. Interesting. Uranium rods. Super rod. Is almost full. It's pretty sick. Okay. So, we need mutagen 2s and fertilizer 1s. And we're low on fertilizer 1s. Let's get some water. Come on. There we go. I think the issue we're running into here... What is the issue we're running into here? Fertilizer 1 requires algae, sulfur, and eggplant. So let's go... Eggplant has some. Um, I forget where we put them. Up here. Algae is empty. And sulfur is al is also empty and you are demanding okay so what i'm learning there is i need a few more drills oops let's go here boop 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 whoa you have a thingy waiting for me that is awesome i'm so excited and there's also something in my eye Wah. okay well that makes me happy that we had a batch of bees waiting that's awesome Because I'm pretty sure we're going to need more um, crop. Outside crop. Okay. Alright, we're going to dump the rest of the uncommons. Yeah. And we're going to throw down two grow beds real fast. But we don't have the fertilizer again. So in that case, let's focus on the drills. Three of you, three of you, three iridium. Lol. And then a ton of titanium, which we set up a drill for. So that should help a lot. All right, now let's teleport to... S that was not what I meant to click on. Let's try that again. Uh, Sulfos me, please. We have five? What? How do we have five and you guys are not able to get... What the heck are we doing? Making me worry. Wait, 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 just a darn minute. Wait just a darn minute. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Home. My brain just exploded. Hang on. Unless I'm mistaken, and I'm pretty sure I'm not. Uh, uh, sulfur is a universal resource. You can mine it from anywhere. Which means I can tear up all those drills and put them all right here, next to the base. So there's no travel time. One more. As I say, it's not gonna... It's not gonna let me put this here. It's too tight. Yeah. Come on. There we go. But yeah, these ones here... I literally went to place a bunch of the drills at the other location, and then my brain went, wait a minute. Yeah, like, no joke. We, we don't need to have any there at all. I forgot about that. Once you hit the tier threes, see, it's only tier two, ones and twos that have to be here. The rest can be at home.
don't have the resource slots for that. Yeah. All right. So let's go home. Okay. And then, yeah, out this way. Yeah, I literally had just a brain fart moment where my brain went, wait a minute. Aren't these, like, already a thing? And I went, oh, yeah. There we go. Supply, sulfur. See, and this is one of those moments where, like, I'm really looking forward to the new update because I can't wait to see what changes they've done. I know they said they've redone a bunch of the um, biomes, which I'm excited for. Let's go up here, dump the sulfur. I also have one random cobalt that I picked up along my travels. And then we're gonna fast travel back to the sulfosmi. Oop, not that way, this way. With this, with this, we're going to go like this. We're going to replace the portal here, and we're going to name you Osmium, and then we're going to slap down a beacon, change the color, oh, uh, Osmium, and then we're going to change the color to kind of a darkish blue, like that. How are you guys doing? Nice and empty. Good, good. Head home. I could have thrown down... Let's, let's do that real fast, actually. While I'm thinking about this, let's throw down one more drill here. Set you to osmium. Supply osmium. And you do have an auto crafter that can see all four. Perfect. Yeah, so there we go. That will take care of Osmium now. Let's head home. Oh. Nobody looked. There were two uncommons. Ooh, and a rare. Um The, the annoying part, though, is that the, the rares, like I've said in the past, are relatively worthless. There's, and, and I'll show you real fast why I say that. Let's go home. Okay, so if we, if we go upstairs and come over here, right? The ones that require a rare... Yeah, so starting off early, right? So this one is only a 230%. 250%, 300%, 500%. So the butterfly Emio larva is the first larva, or the first larva that requires a rare larva that is better than the purple ones, the uh, Futura, the Futura. Um, it's the first one better than the Futura. And the Futura is super easy to get. You literally just stand in the mushroom biome for seven seconds and you get them. And that's why. That's why it's like, wait, you know? Okay. Um, do we have more fertilizer ones? We do. Fertilizer twos. Supers and water. One, two, three. Super. One, two, three. Okay. And then... Just looking at my inventory for everything that we have. Let's pull out the bees. Sweet. And there's a chance that as soon as I unlock the insect rocket, I'm going to have to launch at least one immediately. Maybe two, just because I'll need the resources from it. Okay, so we determined right off the bat that we require... I have a drill still. Let's do that. Let's do one more drill. <clears throat> I'm doing this first because I want to fill my inventory with iron. There we go. Yeah, 
I want to come up here and I want to go to the iron chest. Yeah, and I want to extend this platform before I throw another layer of stuff on it. So we want to go like that. Because sometimes this game gets a little cranky at you when you um, have something like this already down and it's like l over the lip of this and then you try to place another one, the game doesn't always let you. Sometimes it gets a little cranky. And then you have to tear it up to move it, so. Amen, there we go. Um, Amen again. I should have enough here for three of these. Oh, hello uncommon. Another uncommon, hello my my beautiful boys. My hands are not as steady as they used to be. Okay, so squash, we got one mushroom, one eggplant. One squash, one eggplant. Eggplant, squash, mushroom. All right, so you are squash, and we will set you to supply squash. And then you are doing mushrooms, and we will set you to supply mushrooms, okay? You are doing eggplants, and we will set you to supply eggplants. There's a good chance, <coughs> there's a good chance that I open up a third row and then throw down more of these. <coughs> Yeah, and realistically, I could do two fairly easily. The The main issue right now is we desperately need the fertilizer, both one and two, because we're going to need a lot of them. Like, one of our rockets requires it, and then pretty much everything biological requires it. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, algae was our other bottleneck. Which also requires fertilizer, by the way. We are out of bioplastic. Oh no. It's because you require bioplastic, don't you? No. Who's using bioplastic? Not you. The circuit boards are. How's our circuit boards looking? You're empty. Boards. Hang on. Ah, got it. I figured it out. <clears throat> I was going to say, there's something missing here. Three of you. Three of you. Three of you. And then one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay. We are going to come down here. Can we manage to sneak another, yeah, I was about to say, another one of you right there. Perfect. And then we want two more on this side. Okay. This one here is going to be a titanium. Supply titanium. You are going to drill silicon. And you're going to drill silicon. Supply silicon. Supply silicon okay so right there we have two titaniums two silicons a crap ton of sulfur which is good because we need a lot of sulfur for our projects how is our sulfur doing by the way now that we have so many drills no <laughs> how's it doing the answer is horrible oh is that because of this are we trying to fill this with explosive powder we are but that means we're only this far away from being done. Which is which is good for two reasons. One is once this chest is full of explosive, the um, iridium, which is suffering, right? Because we don't have a lot of iridium or iridium rods. Those are suffering and that will start to fill up. Also the sulfur, which we've been massively mining through Every second we get one, we immediately make another explosive. So we need this to fill up. We need the other one to fill up, and then we'll be much better off. 
Also, let's check our pulsar for a minute. Holy smokes, we blinked and we have pulsar now. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. I have a lot of larva in my inventory for some reason. Yeah, let's get you out of here. Okay. And then we just need a crap ton of super. We need one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, and four. Okay. Because here's what I want to do. I want to come up here. And I want to do this. Like that. Dope. See, because I can help expedite the process because these explosive powders, a lot of them are just being wasted in that slot. Yeah. Dump those. Go to water. Dump those. We have a lot of water now. Uranium rods. We got a bunch of those. Extra super. Oh, that did not work. For some reason when I maybe it's my pinky's weak when I hold down on control with my pinky did it again drop the water I'd rather drop the water yeah see look at that that rocket launch only netted us 180 and we need thousands to move on okay super explosive Uranium rods. Yeah, look at that. And it makes sense because once we once we have a forest of these bad boys up, there's no reason to have anything else. Now, this is something I'm even thinking about here. We might have to like triple the size of this and then rip this guy up with the energy fuse. We might have to take that energy fuse. In fact, here, let's... Okay, that does tank my power. Can I look here and while the power's off, and will this tell me how much? 21 versus 19. That's actually not that bad. We can go like this. Like this. And <laughs> it's funny enough. That. Because we have enough of this to go... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then super to go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Yeah, because at the moment what we're doing is we desperately we desperately need to get our portal opened, and we can't currently. Because we need another energy fuse multiplier. So we'll stick you in there now, since we're not using you now, thank heavens. Um, explosive is full put you in there yeah once this fills up here this is our, our little buffer once this fills up the iridium and the sulfur will both fill up immediately which is good because iridium hasn't gotten very full and we desperately need this to be completely full so that we start getting rods okay so um, what we saw there while I was counting is we have unlocked the insect rockets and the insect rockets, we need to launch. They take three bees per. I thought it was two. Oh my gosh, they're so expensive. Fertilizer? <laughs> A fertilizer. And you don't have any more. That would only give me five. Well, I can launch one insect rocket, and that's it. So we need mutagen two. Which I also don't have much of. One osmium rod. And then one... Ooh, rockets are upstairs. Rocket. Which we have one of. Do we have an automatic... Whoa, that was a squeak. Do we have an automatic rocket launcher? We do not. I need an automatic rocket maker. And I don't have one currently. Hey, boys. Hey, hey, we finally have reached a net positive on our drones. Thank heavens. 
I'm actually really excited for this. I'm going to throw one more row out. I'm going to 